Hi friends, uh, so here you see my daily smoothie, morning smoothie. This is why I grow microgreens. This smoothie has uh, a banana, a pear, a handful of walnuts, two tablespoons of oats, and about a hundred grams of sunflower uh, microgreens and some water just mixed up in a blender and uh, ideally I would have um, broccoli with that but uh, did not have it this morning so one of the questions I have is uh, do the uh, seeds go through the openings in the trays and uh, move into the flood tray um, Certainly they don't for sunflowers, but they may for uh, the brassica mix that I have. So this is kind of low light, but you can see that some have moved out. Also, I have an issue that it smells like an aquarium in here. It doesn't smell good. Um, maybe that's coming from something growing in the nutrient solution. Or maybe that is from decaying holes. But uh, I don't know yet what, where that's coming from. I'm running the flood. You can see how high the water gets. It's not quite full. That's about full right there. And it'll start to drop. I think I have it on uh, 60 seconds. Maybe 90. Gotta look. Anyway, that is full. And it just turned off, so now it's going to be draining back down. So it's day five of that grow. And that means I'm going to start another seeding. And since seeding directly into the tray worked, uh, I'm going to do it again. So I just poured it in. 200 grams of sunflower seed, organic, and 40 grams of the uh, brassica mix, the basic salad mix that I've been using. This time I'm using inverted trays. So I'll give it a try without weight on it, see what happens. I'm weighing out uh, my nutrients and salts, and uh, this is a liter of hot water. I'm going to mix it in that and then pour it directly into the bucket. Okay, two, one gram of magnesium sulfate, one gram of calcium nitrate, did I say one? Two grams of calcium nitrate. Two grams of tomato hydroponic fertilizer. Stir it up and it dissolves really well in hot water. Hopefully there's no uh, chemical reactions happening because I've mixed them all together at a r relatively high concentration. So I'm going to add a little bit of water to that. Total dissolved solids is about 320, roughly. And my base water is 150, roughly. pH is right at 6.0, so I leave it there. I have been putting pH down in. Um, because my water tends to be pretty high, 7 point something, 7.4 or 5, something like that. So I have uh, reset my uh, system and the pump is pumping and uh, I've got another batch on the way. Thank you for watching.